Hey guys, what's up Virgo? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future. The situation and the obstacles in your way and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours and leave the rest behind. Alright, Virgo. If this does resonate. Please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys want to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. Alright, immediate future. What's the word for the Virgs? Okay, thanks. All right, the magician, temperance, Sagittarius, energy, and the nine of cups. You are ending with wish fulfillment, but so something's trying to happen. I don't know if somebody's a little bit defensive here or there's a reason. Maybe somebody is just healing because it feels like there's a little bit of a, maybe a waiting period. But show me the magician because with the magician, um, that's about manifesting. And somebody is working hard to do that. It may be difficult. It may be very challenging for whatever this is that you're trying to manifest. All right. Well, cool. So it has to do with your heart space or something that you're very emotionally attached to. You also see it as a wish. I don't think it's very easy to make happen, but I think you're going to work very hard for it. But with the uh, high priestess there, whatever it is, keep it to yourself. Uh, for the time being. Yeah, it's been a slow moving pr process. This is your energy. So things are moving. Just you got to remember the Knight of Pentacles is the slowest moving night of the deck. So slowly but surely you're working hard and you're making it happen. But there's nothing easy about it. Show me this temperance card. Whoosh. So remember, temperance is Sagittarius energy, right? But it's almost like somebody's going for the gold here. Even if it does take a while, slow and steady wins the race. The Ten of Pentacles, it's about marriage and commitment. And I think that's what you're going for. Even, well, something that's stable, something that's loyal. This person could be at a distance, could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, ooh, or Capricorn could have been an ex there's but like i said you've been healing somebody could have just like jumped ship ghosted the situation abandoned the situation okay but they're still there aquarius energy with that star card there's somebody i mean it's it's even if this because i see there's a situation right and it could have been something long term or something that was supposed to be committed, loyal, things like that. But there's been a waiting period, a healing period, possibly not even speaking. But with that star card and that five of pentacles, I'm going to tell you what. Yeah, there's been some pain around this situation. Somebody is definitely, they're still there. See it as a wish. Yeah, communication may be blocked. And you could have went through, shit, even nine years of it. But um, it's been a struggle. But it looks like somebody, show me that nine of wands before I say that. Yeah. So you may have been more focused on your work lately. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, energy. You could have blocked this person or like definitely had some defenses up towards them. And just more so focused on your money, your job, your career. Show me this outcome for Virgo. You have both wish cards here. So even if it's around your career, right? It, you could have been really working hard and trying to bust ass, come out of some, you know, come out of poverty, things like that. It's gonna, it's gonna pay off. So keep going with it. Definitely money could be approving, but show me the six of pentacles. You're getting your wish here for the outcome. 
yeah uh, okay, Libra energy. There could be, could have been a legal situation, but things are regaining balance even within, it looks like um, a particular situation because we have justice there. So justice has to do with, with uh, karma. So it's like whatever you're working on, you're going to make sure that shit is fair and equal give and take if it's money that's been lacking or you know you've been working hard on a project or trying to get even your career off the ground that's opening up some balance show me this um i mean balancing out show me this justice card yeah there's communication things gonna move forward because the eight of wands is all about forward movement and pushing forward show me the six of pentacles though because if this is a person um karma's there so i can looks like you're gonna demand some balance here the knight of wands and the queen of wands it feels like you're really um Wait, you could just be single out there and having choices. You could have um, a couple people trying to pull your energy here. Because with the Nine of Wands, this, um, yeah, the Nine of Pentacles and this Queen of Wands, um, you definitely could be like single and looking to get back out there. And you have um, communication coming and a couple of people in that case would be pulling your energies and possibly one that has been left out behind. Um, but it looks like things are going to take off extremely quickly for you. Especially if money's been lacking, that's picking back up. If this is a person from the past um, that's communicating or things moving forward with them, I uh, don't love the, the... Yeah, you definitely could have somebody returning here. Um, just make sound decisions because it, it really looks like you're you're getting some type of balance and some type of forward movement. It could be communication, um, but I don't think you're going to let anything stop you. Money is improving and you're taking off. You actually could have a couple of people here competing for you, um, especially somebody who possibly you've healed over or, or could have just ghosted a situation. But this really feels like balance is being restored on all levels monetary and you know not really settling down into like a relationship yeah i don't think you're so much interested in that or this particular person i think you're finding balance elsewhere actually and you're feeling good you're feeling confident about that you're feeling happy all right virgo i hope this helps i hope it resonated if so please make sure that you like and subscribe below if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading you can find that information below as well you guys take care and i'll see you next time bye